Good morning, everybody. I'm sure you've enjoyed your chat with uh, Prof. Liesel van Dijk thoroughly. And now I am going to give you just a quick overview on how this week of Femme Engineering will work. So who are you listening to? You are listening to me, Sanai Rent. I am a lecturer at the Northwest University at the Faculty of Engineering. I am a, an electrical engineer with specialization in the power systems um, area. So how are things going to work in this week? Firstly, all of our events will be streamed live on YouTube on the scheduled time. But I know that some of you will, are unable to attend the live event. Don't stress in this case. You can view the videos at a more convenient time, as all of the videos of the day will be available after the stream ends. A Femme Engineering playlist will be created on the NWU's YouTube site, where you can access all of the Femme Engineering videos after the stream has ended. So what is the program for this week? So I'm quickly going to get walk with you through the program just to make things a bit more clear for you and as well as how things will work during this week. So we already had our welcoming and our keynote address by Prof. Liesel van Dijk, the Executive Dean at the Faculty of Engineering. You are currently now listening to me, the launch of the virtual event, and after this you will do your DIY project. Between 12 and 2 you will have a break where no events will be streamed on the site. At 2 o'clock, the streaming will start back up and we will have a keynote address by Prof. Lienta Grobler. She is the team lead of medical device development and commercialization at the Northwest University. She, her area of focus in e-health, moving towards intelligent health. After Prof. Lienta Grobler, we will have Joannika Schneidler, a product specialist at Nasdaq Sweden. We will have a fireside chat about moving the financial world forward as an engineer. Between 4 and 4.15, we will have a break. At 4.15, we will have our first Get Moving class. This will be presented by Specific Strong. And Specific Strong is a Pilates studio in Pretoria and she, she will present a Pilates class for us. Please remember that the Get Moving class is not compulsory. You can do the Pilates class if you want to and this will be streamed on the site. On day two, we will start at 2.30 with a fireside chat by Dr. Uduak Ekpignon, Manager of Asset Management at Oricon Australia. After Dr. Uduak's talk, we will have a talk between 3.30 and 4 about moving your marks closer to the target. Caitlin van der Merwe and Elsa Hutton will be joining us for this talk, where Caitlin van der Merwe is involved at our NWU online tutoring that is available for school learners, and Ms. Elsa Hutton uh, will inform us more about the NWU's engineering requirements as well as other programs that you can get involved in. Between 4 and 5, we will have a Get Moving class that will be presented by FitBest Training. FitBest Training is a training studio in Potterstrom and they will give a moving class for us. Between 5 and 5.15, we will have a short break for you to go to the bathroom, get something to drink, before Dr. Gerard Puerta is joining us for a talk about electromechanical engineering. He will give us a background on electromechanical engineering and just give us a bit more clarity about what it is about. After Dr. Harald, Prof. Alia Grobler um, will be joining us, a professor at mechanical engineering, to give us a bit more background about mechanical engineering. Between 5.15 and 6.15, we invite you and you are welcome to, to ask questions about electromechanical engineering and mechanical engineering in the YouTube live chat, as well as the WhatsApp groups. After the questions to Dr. Harald Puerta and Prof. Alje Grobler, um, we will answer those questions for you. On day 3, August 12th, we will start at 4 o'clock with a Get Moving class by Specific Strong. Between 5 and 5.15, we have a short break to go to the bathroom, get something to drink, 
Before Prof. André Grobler is joining us, um, the Program Manager at Electrical Engineering. He will give us a bit more background on electrical and electronic engineering and just give more clarity about what this course is about. After Prof. André Grobler, Dr. Henry Marais will join us, the Program Manager at Megatronic Engineering. And Megatronic Engineering is offered from next year at the Northwest University. This is a brand new course and Dr. Henry is going to give us a bit more background on what Megatronic Engineering is about. If you have any questions about Electrical Engineering or Megatronic Engineering, please feel free to ask them in the YouTube live chat or in the, or in the WhatsApp groups and we will answer those questions for you between 6.15 and 7.15. On day four, we will also start with our Get Moving class, this time by Fit Best Training. And after the I'll Get Moving class, we will have a short break between 5 and 5.15. Between 5.15 and 5.45, Dr. Teresa Hutting, a senior lecturer at Industrial Engineering, will be joining us. She will give us a bit more background on what Industrial Engineering is about and just to give us a bit more in insight on what it is to be a lecturer at Industrial Engineering. Dr. Melvin Ferreira, will be joining us at 5.45, who is a senior lecturer and postgraduate program manager at Computer and Electronic Engineering. He will give us a background on Computer and Electronic Engineering and what this degree is all about. After Dr. Melvin Ferreira, Ms. Felicity Bupape, a lecturer at Chemical Engineering, will be joining us to give us more insight on what a chemical engineer is and what process engineering on chemical engineering is all about. If you have any questions about industrial engineering, computer and electronic engineering or chemical engineering, feel free to ask them in the YouTube live chat whilst this event is streamed live or on the WhatsApp groups and we will answer those questions for you between 6.45 and 7.45. On day five, a Google form is to be completed by the learners about their first virtual engineering experience. So this Google form is just going to answer you, ask you a few questions about how you experienced the virtual event, what was your favorite event, what was your least favorite event, and the link to the form will be sent on their respective WhatsApp groups. So all of you are added on a WhatsApp group in smaller, um, in smaller groups and in that group all of the links will be sent to you. So how do you ask questions? As I've mentioned before you can use the YouTube live chat to answer to ask questions as well as the WhatsApp groups will be continuously monitored for your questions. And we will try to answer these questions in a quick manner as well as to the best of our abilities. Uh, mentioning my WhatsApp groups, I want to thank all of the NVE engineering students that act as our volunteers. They are your WhatsApp group admins and they help me to answer all of your questions in a quick manner. They also help to package and ship all of the goodie bags before our engineering event. And also, I want to thank the executive team, Prof. Lito van Dijk, for her continuous support of engineering, Prof. Lenta Grobler, the head of the Women in Engineering section at the Northwest University. And a great thanks goes out to, doc to Dr. Uduak Espignon and Veronica Schneidler that agreed to be part of Engineering 2020. Thank you for answering all of my questions and your willingness to participate this year. And a big thanks goes out to our engineering chairperson, Kenneth Van Royen, for all of our logistical help in the past few, few weeks. So now, get ready. We are going to do our DIY project now. So what do you need? You need your Ziploc bag with your components as well as a blank piece of paper. This can be any piece of paper. If you have an A4, that would be preferable. If you have something bigger, you can use that. It just should be any piece of paper. So, get your goodie bag with your components ready 
as well as your blank piece of paper and then we will start with our DIY project. 